Today we put together and executed yet another loyalty test. Dom reached out to me all the way from Los Angeles, California, inquiring about his girlfriend because he thinks she's an opportunist. He explained to me that he'd been in a relationship prior to where his ex left him for a guy with more money and clout and hopes his current girlfriend doesn't do the same being that they live in LA. Why do you want to put your girlfriend to loyalty test? Yeah, she's been showing like, like signs that like she can't be trusted, you know? Like, I kind of went through this before. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? We're like dating an artist and shit like that, so. Trying to see what's real and what's not. I personally collaborated with Uplevel to help put a guaranteed two hundred fifty dollars. Click these apps. Anyone can get the two hundred and fifty dollars, but I am personally interesting. So you guys, we're currently in the airport right now. It's six thirteen. The flight take off at six thirty on the way to LA. Once we land, we will have a bit of a downtime, so that gives us enough time to you know rest up and stuff like that. I haven't talked to Dom because it's a little bit early, and you know the times are a little bit different. But we're gonna tap back in with y'all when we actually get on the flight or when we land in LA. Problem is, I don't know too many people in LA to be the decoy, but I definitely have someone in mind. What's good, bro? What up, bro? You get it? Yes, sir. All right, so look, bro. We got this guy named Dom. He basically reached out to me and wanted to put his shorty to the test because okay. she been coming to him showing him shit on Instagram, basically trying to live a lifestyle that they can't afford. Yeah. So he want to see if opportunity presented itself, would she like? Indulge right. type shit or whatever. So we rented out this, this Airbnb, but we're gonna act like you the host of it, okay. and, it's, and it's your property or whatever. So okay, when she comes in there or whatever, you know what I'm saying? You go basically like show her around, basically what a host would do when you rent out an Airbnb, okay. and then essentially like shoot your shot at her and see if she's right. willing to go on a date with you. Okay. So I'm not. So I'm the Airbnb. Nah, yeah, thank you yeah, for not saying that. So, but she think Dom rented out for her because she's trying to build a portfolio because she acts. Okay. Okay. So she's using the aesthetic of the house. Right. You okay. know what I'm saying? So. However you want to do it, be yourself, you know what okay. I'm saying, and slide your shit in there, however you okay. do it. Is there anything we don't ask the question now? <laughs> Is there anything I can die to? Well, we're going to ask Don when, we, when he get here. Okay, okay. Or whatever. Okay, uh, okay. What, what, what do you want to do? But I feel you. Okay. <laughs> so, I'm not trying to fight over nobody. <laughs> so, literally, the house is literally, like, right there in the hills. Okay, but. Or whatever, and uh, we're going to go ahead and uh, go that way once Don gives me the call. Okay, tell us. Uh, what's up, bro? How's it going? Good, how are you? So what exactly happened, if you don't mind explaining? Uh, man, um, I mean, dating an artist, man, it's just, <laughs> that's hard. I mean, he going through it. I don't know. Or he this just is like, just, this has to be high grade acting. I asked Dom a few questions, he got stuck, and you can obviously tell that he's been struggling with things in his past relationships to where he didn't really want to open up and talk about what was going on. I don't know, like when you're working as an artist, coming up, and like, you with somebody, that person, an artist as well, and then they get around other artists, other people, and then they see like clout, or they see like money or whatever, they kind of choose that, and leave you in the, in the dark and shit, when you feel like y'all locked in. So it's kind of like the same, same, same thing going on right now. I ain't got no proof though. Sure. Yeah. I mean, so yeah, that's pretty much it. So basically, you explained to me uh, through the email that uh, she basically was like trying to live through other people's lifestyles and and like projecting on you because you couldn't give her certain shit. So you yeah, like she was in an opportunity to where he's showing her this house and a certain lifestyle that she would go for it. Yeah, basically. Yeah, that's basically what it is, man. Like. I can't, I can't go through that again, you know what I mean? So, I'd rather just put it to the test. I respect bro for even doing it, you know? Sure. So, bro. Mac, Mary. Peace, peace. Yes, sir. You're be playing the decoy for today's loyalty test. Mm -hmm. Is there anything that you want, you want to explain to him that, he, that you don't want him to do to your girl? Yeah, like, you don't want me to kiss her, touch her somewhere, the special spot, goddamn, say something. Nah, I mean, I mean. Yo, he licking his, his lips. <laughs> These niggas don't <laughs> care. Bro, nigga, and he, yeah. As a man, as a man, like, <laughs> she gonna fold. Are you gonna tell next man he can't go push up on your girl when she folding? Then even if he don't do nothing now, he already gonna get the number or the IG and just spin days after. If you, if you put the action towards it and she fall for it, that give you my answer right yeah. there. You know what I mean? That's so, true. that's really what it is right there. I'm gonna try. Hey, try, man, because... All right. I need to know. Yeah. You know what I mean? I ain't trying to go through that again. Yeah. Kiss her, that's cool. <laughs> it ain't, it's not cool, but it's like if she 
she go for it, she fall. You ain't mad at me. I ain't mad at you. We trying to get that understanding right now, cause you know. That's respectable, young man. Look at how he's smiling. Yo, what's that show? What's that show with the green cartoon character? It's Dex or something? No, it's like some green alien. Oh, and Powerpuff Girls, um, 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 the monkey nigga. No, it's the green nigga with the Frankenstein head. Uh, what show? Nigga said Ben 10. Yo, y'all are seen. done up. <laughs> <laughs> nigga said Ben 10. <laughs> oh, this shit. You remember that sh- this shit, Sammy? Yeah. <laughs> what's, the, what's the evil nigga? <laughs> nah, it's the evil nigga. The nigga that's in charge. Yo. That he look like. I know what you talking about. Evil smile. Just putting babies in evil smiles or some shit. I was talking about this nigga. Let me see if you... <laughs> Yo. Man. Want to get that overstood actually? So, nah. so he's gonna be coming for today's loyalty test, mm-hmm. and Ricardo don't know it, but he's gonna be the photographer for today. Yeah, <laughs> 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 So yeah, uh, we're gonna watch everything from the bedroom upstairs. Mm-hmm. It, got, it got a it got a padlock on the door, so she's not gonna be able to come inside. And right. we're gonna watch everything from the camera up there in the live feed. All right, cool. That's cool. Right, well, Hopefully, get your answer today, and everything goes plan. Right on, man. Right on, right on, right on, right on. Get to it. <laughs> Now that Dom is up to speed, it was time to execute and the plan was already in play. Dom's girlfriend thinks she's arriving to this Airbnb that he supposedly booked for her to shoot photos for her acting portfolio. When the whole entire time we'll be ducked off upstairs watching her walk into her very own loyalty success. Ricardo will be playing the photographer Dom hired while Mavin will be playing our decoy in pursuit to figure out whether she's loyal or not. Cameras were set up and everything was ready. All left to do was wait for her to arrive. Hi. Hello, I'm Ava. Um, my boyfriend actually booked me for a photo shoot. Okay, yeah, come on in. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Uh, so my name is Matt. People call me Macho. Um, this is the spot. Um, what's your name again? Ricardo. Ricardo. Ricardo is going to be a photographer. He's been here for just a little while. Um, so yeah, this is an Airbnb. Um, pretty much have free range to just use whatever space uh, you need. Um, it's better, I say, I think it's better if you take pictures kind of this direction since the light comes in kind of strong, um, until, at least until the, uh, the sun comes down. But um, yeah, I'm just upstairs. Um, what did you say your name once again? Ava. 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 Nice, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Um, so yeah, I'm upstairs if you need me. Well, actually, I'll be back. Um, I'll probably just head out uh, for a while. So if you need me, I think you have my number, right? Okay, so yeah, if you need me, just call me. Um, and um, I'll be back pretty soon. Okay. Mm-hmm. No problem. Hello. How are you? What's up, buddy? She get like a lot of gigs. You said what? She get a lot of gigs. She, she's just working right now. She mean, she on the up and coming. A lot of people like her, you know. Mm-hmm. And she's very uh, passionate in her career. She's so, like, ain't super active right now, but she doing it. Maybe sit in the corner somewhere. Yeah, uh, you can just do whatever pose you're comfortable doing. <laughs> Before we send Mac back in to make this move, we have to make sure that Ava felt like this is a real photo shoot. So Ricardo actually took a bunch of pictures, and when he was done or felt like he took enough, he sent Mac back in. Oh, I like these sideways. You know what? I actually she think got, she like, got him. TP, TP, TP. Really? You can't yeah, see that, bro. Like an awesome photographer. TP, bro. Appreciate it. What's up, y'all? How's What's up, bro? Going? Good. Right? Good? Yeah. Okay. I just came back to check on y'all. How long have you been modeling for? Modeling? Yeah. Um, I don't really want to say model in okay. particular, but um, I do have, like, opportunities for that, so it's kind of big that I am mm-hmm. doing this photo shoot. Yeah. I've been trying to do um, more improv. Okay. But, um... Acting? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So, well, you look like natural in modeling, so... Yeah, look great. I, just, I also got me my political. Okay. Office, okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah. yeah, no, you look great, though. Hey, Ricardo. What's um, up? Can you give us a second? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, shit. Sure. No. Can you excuse uh, Ricardo, um, so. so, acting. Um, how long are you acting? Um, 
<laughs> Bro, okay. I ain't about to and cry. I ran away from the when I was 12 because I was like a teenager. Okay. And then, now that I moved here, city. Damn, nigga. Yeah. Yeah, she's loud. Um, so where are you from? I'm originally from Las Vegas. Las Vegas? Yeah, but I've been out here now for three years. What brings you to LA? Opportunity. Opportunity. Yeah, speaks. Yeah, opportunity. He makes sense. I've been in LA for about a year. Uh, how you liking it so far? Let me ask you before I put my opinion in there. It's different. Different? Yeah. I mean, we got a lot of things going on here every day. Is it better? Worse? I feel like I'm on the median of in between. Okay. Okay. What about you? Uh, I like LA, but uh, at the same time, it's kind of like a little weird. I don't know. I think people are weird. What do you think? Yeah. I, I think I, really the, I think the people are a little weird um, compared to... I'm from Chicago originally. So, like, the way we act and, like, the way we do shit is a lot different than, like, what we going on in LA. But it's cool, though. Other than... I mean, I think the best part is probably how, how it looks. Right. You know what I'm saying? Um, houses like this. Um, you know, I've been doing Airbnb for a while, so... Um, just to see houses like this is cool. Something you don't see in Chicago, but I think I'm ready to leave. Yeah, and go back to your original. No, no, I, I don't want to go back to Chicago. It's a little crazy. I, I might go. I think I'm, I'm, I'm going to move to Miami, maybe. Or maybe like the outskirts. Cool. Yeah, that's what I'm looking at right now. How's the, how's the dating scene out here for you? The dating scene, that's very um, tough out here for me. <laughs> but not that bad. Oh, no, yeah. she already lost me. Not that bad. Why, why not that bad? Why not good? Um, cause I don't really, I don't really get around much. You don't get around? Do you have a boyfriend? Um, I do. You do? Yeah, he sent me here. Oh, interesting. That's your boyfriend that sent you here. Yeah. Okay, how long you guys been dating? We want to say like a year. A Things year? are pretty good. Like, Bro, you gotta go grab that fucking game. Okay, how long you guys been dating? Yeah, like he kind of was going through a bunch of struggles. Okay. Like, you know, with different women that he basically had love for. Right. And... Everything's been going good. Um, but yeah, I feel like we make a good team. Like he's trying to be supportive in my goals, which is really hard to get by. Yeah. And then also I'm in support of his goals. Yeah. What, so do, what does he do, if you don't mind me asking? Um, he's also a filmmaker. Okay. Nigga, don't, don't fake smile. Yeah, he got okay. I hate to ask, I hate to be so, I don't want you to think I'm just being forward, but you, you caught my eye as soon as you uh, walked through the door. Um, yeah, you look like a natural model, and I think you're, I think you look, you definitely look good. Look at stuttering, looking down while he's saying it, like, that's not crazy, bro. Um. And, um, yeah, yeah, I just want to tell you that for him. I know you got a boyfriend. I don't want to be too pushy. Uh, I don't, it's not really pushy because, like, we're, I don't want to say an open relationship, but I don't think he really mind. Mind? No. Why wouldn't he mind? You don't think so? Nah. He's blind. Yo, why didn't you show this nigga face yet, bro? I want to see this nigga face. <laughs> why not? What about what, what, my boyfriend who likes his, or are y'all in love? Let me ask you that. I want to say so. After, what, a year, two years? You gotta be in love, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so why, why would somebody who's in love, they don't really sound natural? Or oh, that's well, not natural, let's just say it don't sound like something everybody says. I don't hear that a lot. Okay, so in an open relationship, I didn't say we consented to that, but mm -hmm. um, other women talk to him because I feel like we're both flirtatious. Flirtatious. Yes, and like before, what I was saying to you recently. You're flirting um, with me. I am flirting with you. I was okay. gonna tell you, you look like you're out of math and math. Okay. <laughs> you <know>? Okay. <laughs> you <your> <laughs> yeah, it's just a little song. It's nothing too crazy. It's just no. a little song. That chain has powers, bro. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. you remember um, that time at let's, the let's, uh, let's go back. To the Yo. Alpha, bro. Okay. You run shit, bro. You so what you were saying? Shit, bro. So I must get, I must get. We actually split up for two weeks, mm -hmm. and he decided that he wanted to go visit one of his girlfriends. His exes, yes. exes, and not necessarily an ex. They were kind of friends, but he told me that at dinner, 
you know, um, he actually caught feelings for her. Is that? But, not in that. Let's sit down, let's sit down, let's sit down. Yeah. Let's sit down. So, I didn't know what he's doing. And I didn't take, like, at heart because... Mm -hmm. Look how they be preparing to whore. She didn't even take one picture. Yo, she not she won't even act like she half care. Yo. He told me that he didn't want to like pursue a mm. relationship with her. Mm. You know? Mm. Oh, I need an invitation. What? Oh, no, I need an invitation. Told you. Okay. I know, yeah, go ahead. Okay. <laughs> but anyways, so that's kinda how we are. <laughs> 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 bro, if I seen that, bro, it's done, bro. It couldn't go farther, bro. The situation done, bro. Nah, nah. Nah, nah, have been stopped nah, nah, like nah cause then over. you're fixing your hair and then you're fixing her ear. No, 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 no. Do no. Sure? Do I need to get fixed? Oh, yeah, do. okay. Do you have permission? Oh, really? Is that in my hair? No, just a little curls. Okay. I okay. just wanted to feel it. Oh. <laughs> Okay, um, so he said he caught, he told you he caught feelings for his ex again? Not an ex. So it was more of like, we kind of split up, kind of, you know, how those mm -hmm. are. Yeah. Or however it goes, same thing for me. Some guy. Yeah, you kind of go, not on a spree, but you just kind of break free for a second mm -hmm. to kind of catch yourself. Yeah. So I'm saying like he went on that date and he basically told me that he feels something for her, which okay. kind of drew like a she a bad liar. Insecurity of I want to see. I want to see if she get touched up. I was like, he then decided that his friend Jace, like, for us to like hook up in the bathroom at a New Year's Eve party. Really? Mm -hmm. Also, he into some freak shit. She don't even know this dude when she's just talking like that, bro. Cause it's true. Right. What is she talking about? I have no fucking clue what this girl talking about. <laughs> that's, that's that's some LA shit right there. Okay. That's that LA shit right there. Did she say you allow somebody else to hook up with her? Come on, man. Is that what she said? Yes, that's what she said. Wait, 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 wait. And what was your response? Because everybody, was everybody without. So I, touching me. I, even if I was trying to like pursue you right now, mm -hmm. why would it matter? You're touching me. I am touching you. I like that. I like that. Scandalous, bro. Maybe something extravagant, you know? Yeah. A helicopter to Malibu or something like that. That is way extravagant. A weekend yeah. getaway? Yeah. Me and you? Completely. I'm I'm done. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, bro, we sitting up there and watching everything unfold, and she just busts out and say that he gave her consent to be with somebody else. Chucky, thank you for that yeah, sub. Well, let me give I you a you. tour of the. Uh... Yeah, I was actually about to say that. Like, I, I'm like so blown away. I'm just so like, I want this house. <laughs> like for real. <laughs> well, maybe you could take it. Maybe you could take it. Uh, see where me and you go, and maybe you can. Uh, maybe this can be the weekend house or. Something like that. This is one of the uh, units that don't get booked too often. It's actually the first one in the last few weeks, so. Yeah. And hey, let me give you a tour. Yeah, let's go. Let me show you around the corner here. Um, and then we can go up upstairs. Why are you bringing her upstairs? He you knows. Know, you know not to come here, right? I tell people all the time, never freestyle when conducting these loyalty tests because now Mac forgot that we was upstairs in a room and they're literally standing right outside the door. Oh, okay. uh, yeah. I know they not about to come in this room, bro. Yo, you're scandalous as fuck, bro. How am I scandalous? This, this, this whole thing is a setup. Hold this, bro. All right, look, so the whole time, um, Don reached out to me because he wanted to put you on a loyalty test because he felt like you was just being disloyal to him for a lot of reasons. Disloyal to you? This, this is what this is right now. What the fuck are you talking about this whole time? Wait a minute. You are telling me right now that you set something like this up and then put me on the pedestal for my career, too? What the fuck do you think? Yes. Why? You're not trustworthy, bro. What the fuck are you talking about? It's her flipping it. 
and trying to say he's destroying her career. I don't. I don't think she his type. <laughs> I don't think there's no way this I think is real. He's, set, he's settling because I don't know. I don't think this is real, low key. She looked like. She looked like. <laughs> a more walk version of blue face baby mother. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, like, nah, I don't know. <laughs> Look at the nigga in the back cheesing. <laughs> oh my god. No, what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, niggas love that, bro. So you just. I did, because you consented it on the phone. What about like last night? You texted me and literally just said you slow? No, I'm not fucking slow. Are you fucking slow? You f my friend. Whatever. This has got to be bro. fake. We, we, we literally heard everything from up here. If you can see, we like watching everything that y'all doing. So we heard, you, you, bro. we heard you confess and say that. You're dirty as fuck. Man. He's just a decoy. He does not own his house. Everything was set up. You're dirty as fuck. You feel dirty as fuck, don't you? You feel dirty and stupid, don't you? No, I don't feel dirty and stupid. I just can't believe That's it. some dirty no, and stupid shit to say no, right there. Because you have like this whole fucking crew set up. You're just like putting on a show yourself right now. And you, I this whole time, you've been acting this whole fucking time. No, time, whole fucking time. You're scandalous, so, man. And then, like, why are the cameras still rolling? You set this fake ass photographer up, and then like these dudes all in the background to get me with a fucking mic that's like picking up on me. Type of shit. <laughs> you don't feel stupid though? You fucking fail, no, bro. I don't care. This is so dumb. I cannot believe that you would Isn't that crazy? Her. He didn't even want to kiss her. Yo. Nigga was talking mad crazy before he seen the gal. Nigga didn't even want to kiss her. Nah. I knew he was. Yo. I he was. Nah. I, I wasn't even holding they her They played. Hand. The fact that she touched him, I would have told her to save. <laughs> <laughs> ah, save. Bro, that is your fucking word, like, safe. What the fuck, bro? What? We have emotion like that. Why can't see the fucking thing? Chucky underscore donated $25. Little motion harder, bless up a real one. I'm not really in here often, but I try to tune in when I can. Being yourself attracts so much PPA to you, and folks appreciate your insight and advice. Keep thank, it up, bro. Thank you, man. Thank you, man. No, man, miss my too much. Do look like a brush, man? The, the, the TP on me. I appreciate you, bro. Thank you. That means a lot, for real. 